My phone in the hotel room rings, and it's the Attorney General. And he opens the conversation. Who the hell is Diane Nash? Call her and let her know what is waiting for the Freedom Riders. So I called her. I said, I understand that there are more Freedom Riders coming down from Nashville. You must stop them if you can. Her response was, they're not going to turn back. They're on the way to Birmingham, and they'll be there shortly. You know that spiritual, like a tree standing by the water, I will not be moved. She would not be moved. And, and, and I felt my voice go up another decibel and another, and soon I was shouting, young woman, do you understand what you're doing? You're going to get somebody. Do you understand you're going to get somebody killed? And there's a pause, and she said, Sir, you should know we all signed our last wills and testaments last night before they left. We know someone will be killed, but we cannot let violence overcome nonviolence. That's virtually a direct quote of the words that came out of that child's mouth. Here I am, an official of the United States government, representing the President and the Attorney General, talking to a student at Fisk University. And she, in a very quiet but strong way, gave me a lecture.